Neighbors in Teleco Plains say they're concerned for how a road closure on the Cherokee National Forest could negatively impact the local economy. 10 News reporter Fernando Garcia Francisini shares why they say it's crucial the Forest Service delays the closure until next year. Danny Cooper has been hunting at the Cherokee National Forest for more than 50 years. And I tell you what, I mean, I've stayed in them mountains and I love it. It's a family tradition, one he might not be able to do this year. That's because the Teleco District Forest Service has decided to close North River Road for the entirety of hunting season, and neighbors are not happy about it. That's not ac acceptable to us. Barry Duckett says this is a big time of the year for tourism in Teleco Plains, and now neighbors worry how closing this road will impact the local economy. By closing this road, it's going to affect all the hunts. Uh, the fishermen, the, the leaf lookers, the jeep riders, uh, which is going to affect a lot of the businesses here in Teleco Plains. And uh, this is their major uh, season for making money. Uh, this could either make them or break them. People in Teleco Plains met Saturday to discuss next steps. They're asking the Forest Service to postpone the closure until the start of the new year, since that's when tourism season has died down. Duckett says, however, Forest Service hasn't agreed to do it. Uh, it. It's very disappointing that the Forest Service won't work with us on this issue. Uh, we've tried to work with them and they just flat out refused. In Teleco Plains, I'm Fernando Garcia Francescini. We reached out to the Teleco District Forest Service for their comment, but we have yet to hear back.